Hey, I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. Ah. Oh, welcome to 10 minutes of feeling good. Kirby's a little tired, but I'm ready to go. Ready to jump ropes yeah. and cross train. Oh. You gotta train hard if you want to be adorable. Oh. All right, take me to where we go. Yay! Onward, Hotland. <laughs> <laughs> hawk, hawk. Oh man, I'm so Ooh. glad we're playing this again. Me too. We almost couldn't find it, and it would put us in a bad mood. Right. But then playing this game is gonna put us in a good mood. Well, pyramid says. Yeah. Also, when I ran to uh, your kitchen and grabbed a handful of Lucky Charms, it was like 98% cereal pieces. I could be pissed off, but not today, my friend. <laughs> not today. We we were actually having this discussion about Lucky Charms, where like if you could buy a whole bag of marshmallows, like would you just eat the marshmallows in milk? And the consensus was no. You would use it to augment your already normal Lucky charm. Yes. So that, that they that would it the would truth. have a higher marshmallow to solid piece. So true. Wait, did we play this level already? Ratio. We, we actually ended the last episode on this level. Oh, so we didn't yeah. successfully beat it. No. Okay. So we got halfway through, and then we were like, next time on Goof Lumps, let's have a party. Yeah. And then nobody came, and then we were really <laughs> fucking sad. Yeah, nice going, guys. Yeah. Thanks for blowing our party. Yeah, <laughs> thanks, guys. Thanks. Also, no. thanks for blowing people at our party. <laughs> you know, that, that saved it, I yeah, think. Yeah, that's actually a legitimate thank you. <laughs> thank you for blowing people at our party. Yeah, wow. And if you're one of the people uh, who got blown, good party, right? Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> you guys really stepped it up. Hey. Down on your knees. <laughs> You really stepped it up on the other day. <laughs> yeah, that's what I was going for. Oh, uh, but I couldn't get the right diction. It's okay. I'll help you with the diction, son. Follow that exclamation. I'll put some diction. Yeah. You? So I have gotten um, uh, a high number of letters from girls uh, saying that this was their favorite thing to watch us play. The Kirby's Epic Yarn one? Yeah. Oh, because it's just so fucking because adorable. Because it's delightful. Yeah. yeah. Like, I, I think everybody likes adorable things. Like, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna be fucking sexist here and be like, yeah, well, only girls like cute things. Guys like cute things too. They're just, they're just scared to admit. I love it. cute things. You're, you you're using a bright pink Wiimote right now. Yeah. Well, it's my favorite Wiimote. Yeah. This one's mine. <laughs> you, you know, pink is my favorite color. Yeah, it is. That's yeah. right. You, you're, is it? Uh, do you like like the pale pink or hot pink? I like all pinks. Wow. Yeah. I just I just like pink. I like blue. Oh, Funny yeah. that we completely picked the reversal of those colors when we were choosing characters in this game. <laughs> well, I like I like Prince Fluff because of his eyes he's and, the his, man. and his eyebrows. Yeah. You he, don't have eyebrows. He's a salty best. Yeah. Mm. Whoop. Oh, I'm determined. <laughs> I like I like nudifying these fucking mummies. Oh yeah. Making them nude. Yeah. I like guys. myself a sexy naked mummy. <laughs> mm. Mm. Wait a second. Hold on. Good, I'm not British. That would have been really weird if I was British and I said that. Hey! I was looking at your mummy! <laughs> I was looking at your mummy! And I... boy, she, she looked real good when she was naked! She was naked! I oh. loved it! Oh. I was looking at some of Ringo Starr's artwork! <laughs> it's crap! <laughs> Did you ever have like a weird, like, kind of like, like sexual realization with somebody else's mom? Oh sure. Like you were over at their house, and like she was just kind of like liberal with like what she wears around the house, and you're oh, like, oh man, mm -hmm. she's all adult and boobed. <laughs> <laughs> boobed. Have you ever seen uh, the uh, uh, music video for Stacy's mom? That song, Stacy's mom. Oh no. It's borderline porn. Really? <laughs> yeah. It's really wild. Yeah. Here we go. Stacy's mom has got it going on. That's She's a, all I want, and I've waited for so long. Stacy, can't you see? You're just not the girl that, for me. That, I know it that, might be wrong, but that, I'm in that, love with Stacy's mom. Whoa, I checked out for a second to sing there. Yeah. I didn't realize we're fucking dune bugging <laughs> with a rocket booster. Woo! I'm the dune buggy, you're the dune bugger. Oh, yeah. I, I'm just like the guy singing with his eyes closed as the wind whips through my Kirby hair. I don't have a problem with it. You cool. can go ahead and sing all you want. You have a beautiful uh, voice. Oh, this guy's got a fucking headband. Let's leave him the goddamn dust. Oops. Oh, damn. Oh. oh, shit. I fucked it up, dude. I That's fucked okay, it big bro. Time. All right, here we go. Oh, this is you. Com oh, okay. Yeah, I'm controlling the car. Okay. Yeah, cool. we got the Pyramid Sands music. Yeah. God, I love this fucking, like... 
jazzy ass like fucking music. Yeah. It probably didn't mesh well with Stacy's mom at all. No, not at all. <laughs> oh well. Nothing meshes well with Stacy's mom except my dick. <laughs> oh my god! Damn. Whoa, look at that! That clam's throwing up gems. <laughs> <laughs> that is a convention that has not been brought over here yet. What? It's a, it's a party, party ball. Oh. It's a, like a Japanese tradition. Oh, that wasn't like a weird looking pinata. It is kind of like a pinata, yeah, but they call it a party ball. Well, I don't know. What <laughs> Japanese word is for it. Sugu boogu boogu boogu. Putty boogu. Boogu 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 boogu. Putty boogu. Oh, would you like it to have a party? Yes. <laughs> well, <laughs> you're in the rock. <laughs> I bring a the ball. <laughs> ball is a fucked up word if you're having difficulty pronouncing the letter L. Bari? As is Rory Pop. <laughs> <laughs> My favorite Woo! American show is A Rand of the Rose. <laughs> <laughs> oh, outstanding. Wow. That's cool. Yeah, hey, good job, Genie. Thank you, Yarn Genie. Mm -hmm. Live in my crown forever. <laughs> All right. You want to give it a rub so the genie can come out? Uh, I want to wish, but I don't want to deal with this bullshit. I know. He always just comes out and does impressions Fuck. of people I don't know. Let's just go to Rava Randy. <laughs> Rava Randy. <laughs> Ooh, this appraise makes me randy. Wait, how do you? Landy? Gotta hit, you gotta hit it. Uh, yeah. Oh, <laughs> it makes me landy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That'd be funny if they just reversed the R's and L's. They do. Well, technically, what they what they say in Japanese is closer to an L. They just call it R for like, oh, God! convenience sake. Wow, good job. I suddenly died. I didn't realize dying diamonds. was even a thing. Well, you don't die. You just lose your diamonds. Or you lose some diamonds. Yeah. It's like Sonic the Hedgehog. Yeah. But even more forgiving. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Sonic the Hedgehog, except... Like, it's like, Oops. you are blessed with immortality. Yep. By the, the genie that's an asshole that we don't want to talk to. Yeah. And you're slow as shit. Oh yeah, we are a little slow. Well, it's because we're yarn. Yeah. You ever tried dropping yarn ah! off a building? Yeah. I haven't. You know but you I'm about to try. <laughs> you know when you drop, like, a penny off a building and, it, and then it could murder? Yes. But, like, dropping yarn off a building is just like... Tink. Uh, <laughs> yeah, you comfort. <laughs> it comforts its way down. Yeah. No, I read apparently you can't, uh, you, uh, if you dropped a penny off the Empire State Building, it would not actually kill someone. Really? Yeah, it can only reach a top speed of 50 miles an hour, which would merely totally fucking suck to get hit with, but would not actually kill you. Aw, uh, well, what if it hit you in, like, the right place? Like the Branium? Yeah, the Branium. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, so the terminal velocity of a penny is 50 miles per hour? No, 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 that's just where it... Oh, terminal velocity, yes. But not terminal as in it would kill you. Wait. Like, just term... Did you mean terminal velocity as Ter in, like, that's where it tops out? Yeah, terminal velocity yeah. is the top speed which gravity can pull right. you Right. I thought you meant terminal velocity, the velocity at which something terminates you. <laughs> <laughs> I, that would just be like the termination velocity. There has to be a shitty action movie called Terminal Velocity. Oh, oh my god. There has to be so at least five. Nice. Yeah. They're, like one of them's made by the Asylum. Yeah. <laughs> the Asi Wait, they're those guys that do like Transmorphers and yeah, stuff? Yeah, I think they did uh, Sharknado. No, they yeah. couldn't have. Really? Yeah, they make the terrible movies. That's their. That's by far their biggest hit. They make the. Um, they make both. The terrible movie knockoffs, yep. terrible blockbuster knockoffs. Oh, come on, Robert. like uh, like 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 warship. What was their what, what was their battleship wannabe? You gotta pull the like, yarn thing. Oh, I'm like, when is this gonna stop? <laughs> Sorry, everybody. Um, I forgot what it was called, like battle cruiser or something stupid oh, like man. that. But uh, yeah. So they make oh. terrible, shitty versions of existing popular movies, and just to trick people who buy the DVDs. Yeah. Just to trick old people. Yeah, like your grandma. Like, I bought my grandson the DVD of Transmorphers. Yeah, he really likes those. He loves the Transmorphers. He plays with all the toys. Mm -hmm. Meanwhile, that's like a like a sexual tension drama. Is it, is it really? Yeah, it's a terrible movie. Oh. We Like, like Ross Whoa. and I... Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> yeah! We are uh, just a little thing of yarn, after all. Whoa! 
Dude, this reminds me of a game that has been long and forever forgotten. What's that? Um, it was for Commodore 64. It was called Alf in the Color Caves. <laughs> yeah, it is old. Woo! Whoa, awesome. Oh, okay. Got it. It's just like, I'm gonna ice this cake! <laughs> oh god, no! <laughs> 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 is there a fire? Is there a baker in the house? <laughs> is there a baker on fire in the house? Oh man, but before this episode ends, I just want to give Elf in the Color Cave some love. It was it was a game in which uh, you were a little blue blob with feet and you dance around and then like change your shape to go in through the color caves. Aww. And I bet it's terrible, but 30 years later or whatever, uh, it inspired a single part of Kirby. Yay. Yay. Good for you, Elf. Yeah, good job. Thanks for giving Elf some love. Yeah. Next time on Game... Oh, yeah. I, ho I, I hope you, uh, hope you wore protection. Nope. Oh, shit, dude. <laughs> I went Elf's got gonorrhea, dude! No! I went... <laughs> I went balls deep into the color cave! <laughs> <laughs> Next time on Game Groups. All right.